Okay, guys, um, I've done some further experimenting. Now, this is my original first prototype Earth battery that I ever made. Um, this was to run some further testing. Now, remember I told you the amount of Earth that you use doesn't matter? I'm about to prove that to you now. And you're going to be really surprised on how much Earth you actually need to produce the same bolt. So we're going to move that across and bring in our new battery. Yes. I'm just going to show you. It's just some dirt, which is dry. It's actually clay. Here's a piece of copper, a piece of zinc coming out of it. That's it. And nothing else to it. Results will speak for themselves. Move that across. Bring in our volt meter. Okay. Now we put our volt meter. It's a bit tricky. So I have to make sure to do this so you guys can see it. You can see it's 0.7. So we've gone from that to this. Oh, I've gone too far back here. Here we go. and holding and that just goes to prove now for all those skeptics out there that say what's in there it's just dirt there you go there's the connectors it's actually really dry there's no moisture in it because it was clay and it still works, giving us a reading of 0.6 to 0.7, which is really interesting. It's going to really help um, me make a better battery, one that can give us some serious amount of voltage. Okay, I'll see you next time.